now can you still see her? No. Okay, now take your hand away. Now can you see her? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's Larry do this one. Okay, which balloon do you want him to shoot? Shoot the orange. Orange, Larry. Well, okay, nice time. Diana, which color do you want her? Okay, do it yellow. Nice Michelle. Let's Michelle do it. Okay, you have the last one. Do you need glasses? <laughs> <laughs> okay, put it blind. Blindfold. Okay. Oh, Larry. Do it. Now, Good job. I'm Dr. Singh. I'm an ophthalmologist. I practice in Westchester. Um, uh, Dr. Galati and I are, are, are good friends, and um, you know, I, he invited me down here, and I had a normal, healthy dose of skepticism. And uh, you know, I, I do not have an explanation for what I've seen here today, and that's why I think it certainly warrants further study. Because if this is what's happening here, is truly. Uh, you know, a, a bona fide way of, of helping the handicapped, then this is, would be a real, uh, real boon to mankind. I'm Dr. Dana Cohen. I'm an internist, board certified here in New York City. Um, and I also came very skeptical. Um, but with, with a, but open minded. And um, I am just also kind of at a loss of words <laughs> um, and I think um, this is just so exciting for me um, I I can't wait to hear more about it to see more more students to to delve in and learn more about what's going on here with um, with Mark the teacher what you have seen today is almost a miracle that has never been done before Mark Commissaro, who is next to us, is, uh, was our teacher. And Mark, how did you feel about your class that you had right now? Uh, you know, that is a goal of my life because uh, I'm 57 years old and for a long time, about 50 years old, I did not know why I came here to this earth. Now I know why. And I'm feeling about my class. It's amazing. They do the job and they were excellent. You saw it by yourself. Thank you, Mark. What you have witnessed today may be perhaps the next generation of human beings. What Mark has managed to achieve is to teach young children of 10, 12 years old how to read and see without using their eyes or with the eyes blindfolded. Our research has shown that they're actually starting to use a portion of their brains on top of their head, uh, which mankind has never used before in their lifetimes. Now, only about 8% of the brain, according to research, is presently used by human beings. Perhaps with Mark's invention, we're creating a, an opportunity for mankind to start using another portion of the brain and as a result, it may give us two wonderful benefits. The first one is it will give us a chance to teach blind children in Asia and India and America, millions of them who live their lives without any vision to be able to see again. And what a wonderful gift to mankind. And secondly, the ability for young children to open up their minds and increase their IQs to perhaps over 140 and more and create a brand new generation of super intelligent human beings that may bring all kinds of joy and happiness to us in our lives. I'm Dee Gulati from Patients Medical, 800 Second Avenue, Suite 900, New York, New York, 10017. And our phone number here, if you have any questions, is 212-661-7673. Again, 212-661-7673. And I'm Dee Gulati wishing you a good night. <laughs>